Hello everybody and welcome to this lesson. We want to build our project. So basically you need to go to into your Unity 3D, run it, and we're just going to get started with a new project. So I'm just going to go File, New Project, and I'm just going to choose 2D. And here I'm just going to type my project name. So I'm just going to type Unity 3D Professional 2D Game and select Create Band. All right, we got our project. First step, we need to create a new folder here for our scenes. So the scenes are the the generic container for the levels of our game. So I'm just gonna get started with the first scene. So this is gonna be the scenes folder. It's just a logical folder name for organization of our project so I'm just gonna name my first scene here and save a scene into this folder so I'm just gonna select the scenes and I'm just gonna name it level 1 so this is our level 1 after you save the scene you can run it but as you can see here on the screen we don't see nothing because nothing on the screen we don't have any object we just got the camera and if you select the camera and zoom out you can see this area of the screen of the scene here if you click on this tab this is the area of the scene or behind the scene area but this game is the actual area of the game so we work behind the scene on the scene section any changes in the scene section gonna be reflected in the game section so using the camera here we can see all the elements in the game using the camera so you can move the camera to the left to the right by selecting the selection tool or you can also move it to the top to the bottom to the top using 2d games we're talking about two axes the y-axis and the, the x-axis so this is the y-axis and this is the the x-axis where we move horizontally so I'm just gonna reset my camera to the default position so I'm just gonna select the position here control a zero click enter and go to the second y I'm just gonna set to zero to be centralized on our screen so we're just gonna check 10 16 because we want to work on a portrait game we have we can choose free aspect it depends on the game that you want to develop in this series we want to work on a portrait screen so that's why we choose 10 16 as a ratio for our screen so I'm just gonna save the scene and I'm just gonna create a new folder here in our assets and I'm just gonna name it sprites sprites are the the graphic elements that we use in development of our game so in this case we're talking about these sprites we have the plier the plier got two sprites this is the first one and this is the second one so we need to navigate between these two so we need to make an animation so we're gonna do this in the next video and also we got a background which is the background for our game we got coins and we got obstacles which are flat boxes as you can see here so these are called the sprites of our game so basically I'm just gonna import them into our project by select them all and go to the sprites folder select all the sprites and drag them all into the sprites folder so right now we got all the sprites in our sprites folder I need to improve the quality of the graphics so I'm just gonna select control on the keyboard keep pressing and select all the images here and choose the format to be true color in order to get the maximum quality I need to click apply in order to get the maximum quality of our images in order to work them in the following couple of videos so thank you guys for watching this lesson in the next video we're just gonna get started with our player and adding animation to it and adding, adding them to the game 
So see you in the next lesson. Thank you.